welcome back to Woody Bay Station. Today we thought we'd talk to you about something that we consider to be an absolute jewel in the crown, which is our heritage carriage fleet. In 1935, when the railway closed, all of these carriages along with the locomotives and all of the railway was all auctioned off. Many of these carriages ended up spread across various areas of Devon, becoming summer houses, chicken coops, sheds, all sorts of things. They were later discovered purely by chance by various members and research that found many of these vehicles or pieces of these vehicles and brought them all back together, which started the project that you see today. So the restoration of what are now award-winning carriages was led by the LNB East Group in Essex. Through huge contributions over many decades by many of our own members, these carriages were carefully restored into what you can now see today at Woody Bay. I'm currently here in a third class coach, fully open, designed to take uh, up to 40 people on these very nice varnished wooden seats. So we have two guards coaches on the railway. I'm currently sat in coach number 16. Easy to tell by the guards handbrake, access to the vacuum brake system. It has ducats so you can look down the side of the train nice and easily and an end window. The great thing about these brake vans, they have such large luggage areas, it's allowed us to convert them and to allow disabled people access to the trains. And this means anybody in a wheelchair can travel with their family and friends along the railway. So similar to Coach 11, we also have many third class compartments. These prove very popular with our visitors as they often provide a much more sort of a heritage feel to your journey. For anyone that wants to treat themselves, we are lucky enough to have several different types of first class compartments available. First of all, we have this blue velvet compartment. And we have a red leather compartment. With all of these first class compartments, they have been lovely and restored, great attention to detail, to appear exactly as they did originally. Everything from luggage racks, photographs, antimacassars, and down to the seat material. So of course, being on Exmoor brings its own challenges. The coach number 17, as you can see here, is just fresh out of the paint shop today. This is the last one of all five of the carriages that have passed through the paint shop since COVID. In one of our earlier videos, you saw many of our volunteers busy working away on this carriage. It has taken many skills from woodwork, paintwork, upholstery work to bring it up to what you now see today. So as an example, this section here was completely rotten. This has taken a lot of work to cut it out, repair the frame, and then cosmetically repair the outside. So this coach contains this observation compartment, which is extremely popular to visitors, which offers unparalleled views of Exmoor. Now these carriages, of course, take a huge amount of upkeep. We have to say thank you to all of those people involved. That's our engineering staff, our paint shop staff, the wood team. We have a considerable support from the team in Essex. And of course, to all the people that donate in any way to helping us keeping these carriages running. So we very much recognise our responsibilities of looking after these historic vehicles, which is why we've been looking at all sorts of options of how we can shelter these vehicles to save them for future generations. So there we go. Thanks for watching. And remember, if you like our videos, don't forget to like and subscribe.